Hello future engineers, welcome back to Cutoff 360. In this MST set series, we'll be discussing about the VIT Pune Round 2 official cutoff rank. Also, we'll be doing a comparison with the Round 1 cutoff to understand the difference between how the cutoff has changed from Round 1 to Round 2. So make sure to stay till the end of this video. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe the channel to get more updates on such videos or college-wise cutoff. So first in the list we have civil engineering. So as you can see on screen, for round 2 G open category, the cutoff rank was 18,347. Whereas in round 1, the cutoff rank was 17,109. Next, for GOBC category, the cutoff rank is 22,475 for round 2, whereas in round 1, the cutoff rank was 22,133. So, as you can see on screen, uh, for GOPEN category, there is almost a one point increment in the cutoff, whereas there is a very slight difference of 200 rank in, in for GOBC category between round 1 to round 2 cutoff. Next, moving ahead, we have computer science another most demanding and most popular course. So as you can see on screen for G open category, the cutoff rank is 3,729. Whereas in G uh, for round one, the cutoff rank was 3,505. So there's a almost 200 rank increment in the round two cutoff compared to round one cutoff. Whereas for GOBC category, you can see that the cutoff rank for round 2 is 4690 whereas in round 1 the cutoff rank was 4187 so there is almost a drop uh, increment of 400 rank in between round 1 to round 2 cutoff candidate can make use of this uh, comparison to estimate the chances of increment in the future round of counseling and based on that he slash she can decide whether he, uh, they want to confirm the allocated seat or proceed with the betterment in the round 3 counselling. Next in the list we have information technology. So as you can see on screen for GOPEN category, the cutoff rank is 4951 in round 2 whereas in round 1, the cutoff rank is 4811. So as you can see on screen, there is a very slight change in between the round 1 and round 2 cutoff. When it, whereas in when it comes to GOBC category, in round 2 the cutoff rank was 5527 whereas in round two round one the cutoff rank was 5236 so at least there is a difference of 300 points in between round one to round two in gobc category next in the list we have electronics and telecommunication engineering so as you can see on screen for geopen category the cutoff rank is 7940 whereas in for geopen category in round one the cutoff rank was 7640 so there is a difference of almost 300 points Whereas when it comes to GOBC category, the cutoff was 8,787 for round 2, whereas in round 1, the cutoff rank was 8,548. So in both the categories, which is GOPEN and GOBC, there is a very slight change between the round 1 and round 2 cutoff. So in the round 3 cutoff, candidate can expect the similar kind of changes that which is a drop, a, a increase in the like 300 to 350 points between cutoff. Moving ahead, we have instrumentation and control engineering. So for GOPEN category, in round 2, the cutoff rank was 16,287, whereas in round 1, the cutoff rank was 16,199. For GOBC, the cutoff rank was 17,577. So for GO, uh, in round 1, the cutoff rank was 20,870. So the cutoff rank has dropped between round 1 and round 2. So candidate can expect our uh, expected rank for 20, uh, round 3 for GOBC between 17,000 to 19,000. Moving ahead, we have computer science engineering for AIML. So for GOPEN category, the cutoff rank is 5,349, whereas in round 1, the cutoff rank was 5,328. So for when it, whereas when it comes to GOOBC category, the cutoff rank was 5,845 for round 2, whereas in round 1, the cutoff rank was 5,843. Next in the list, we have CSE in data science. So for GOPEN category, the cutoff rank was 6920 in round 2, whereas in round 1, the cutoff rank was 6670. Whereas when it comes to GOBC category, the cutoff rank was 7216 for round 2, whereas in round 1, the cutoff rank was 7055. Next, we have CSE artificial intelligence. So for GOPEN category, the cutoff rank was 7399 for round 2 
whereas in round 1 the cutoff rank was 6163 for GOBC category the cutoff rank was 7676 in round 2 whereas in round 1 the cutoff rank was 6626 moving ahead we have computer science and software engineering so for GOPEN category the cutoff rank was 6885 for round 2 whereas in round 1 the cutoff rank was 6191 when it comes to GOBC category, the cutoff rank was 7436, whereas in G round 1, the cutoff rank was 7149. By checking these comparison between round 1 and round 1 and round 2 cutoff, candidate can estimate the expected cutoff for the round 3 and, and decide whether to opt for the float process which is going to the round 3 of counselling or accept the allocated seat in the round 2 counselling. Next in the list we have artificial intelligence and data science. So for GOPEN category the cutoff rank was 6612 for round 2 whereas in round 1 the cutoff rank was 6531. When it comes to GOBC the cutoff rank was 6955 for round 2 whereas in round 1 the cutoff rank was 7059. Moving ahead we have mechanical engineering. So for GOPEN category, the cutoff rank was 11,460 for round 2, whereas in round 1, the cutoff rank was 11,305. When it comes to GOBC category, the cutoff rank was 15,545 for round 2, and for round 1, the cutoff rank was 15,099. Thank you for watching the video. If you like the video and the data present in it, then make sure to like and subscribe the channel. Also, if you wish to know the cutoff for any specific course or college or category, then make sure to comment down the same in the comment section and our team will be replying for the same. Thank you.